This morning we are highlighting another incredible high school senior set to graduate soon. Education reporter Elsa Gillis introduces us to this Union County teen who has strength and a drive that will inspire you. Right now I'm just taking it one day at a time. <laughs> yeah, uh, I'm just so excited to be done with school <laughs> at this way. And yeah, I don't know. We'll just we'll see what's next. Take a look at these senior pictures. Elizabeth Brooks' smile is contagious and her spirit and drive even more so. She's one that just does without being asked. Um, she tries to keep peace, um, you know, with siblings and all. Um, she certainly has a uh, feisty side and I saw that early on in her life. And, you know, I think that the Lord gave that to her for what she was going to have to go through. And she has fought her way through it and has stood strong in her faith and has just been such an influence on so many people, um, young and old alike. When the Union County teen was just 12 years old, she was diagnosed with Ewing sarcoma. Now at 17, she's fighting a second relapse. But through the years of ups and downs and travels back and forth to St. Jude's in Memphis, their family has worked to keep life pretty normal. And Elizabeth has never stopped fighting with joy and never stopped her schooling. She was always homeschooled, and as she went through chemo, her mom says she'd have to force her to take a break. A lot of people have heard of what they call chemo brain, and I'm here to tell you it is a real thing. Um, we, I finally had to just say you, you cannot do school during weeks of chemo. She just continues to push herself, so it's exciting to me that she is able to finish this year like she should anyway. And um, I'm excited to see what, what she'll do next. So what is next for Elizabeth? Oh, I am so excited. It's like, yeah, just crazy that like next year <laughs> I won't be doing school. She's set to finish senior year at the end of July, and she plans to continue working on her family's farm where she grew up. She runs their social media website and tends to the chickens. Elizabeth also began working at her father's tractor business. So this soon to be grad is a model for us all and fellow students on juggling a lot with grace and soaking up life. Enjoy where you're at right now. Um, you know, as for school, you will finish sooner than you think. And then um, just going through a tough time, you know, just look to your faith or your family um, because you may not realize now how much they mean to you, but um, when you go through something tough, like, they mean so much more. Elsa Gillis, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. I really wow. like that. Enjoy where you're at right now, even if it doesn't seem, you know, all that great. Make yeah. the most. Yeah, she's an inspiration for everyone. Mm -hmm.